Should we try it from here? Okay. Grace be unto you and peace from God our Father and from our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. So this is the gift season, isn't it? Christmas gifts began with what we call the gift of Jesus. Jesus was brought into life as a gift for all of humanity. It's a gift that is given to each one of us. It's not something all in itself, but it's something that is given away. And that's the way Jesus lived, didn't he? He took what was given to him, brought into human existence, and used all of that for the benefit of all of humanity. Have you ever thought of the possibility that you too are as a gift? God's gift? God's gift, God's gift, God's gift, 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 gift. Yeah. So, what is a gift for? Not itself. The gift is always for the other. Is that the ultimate reality of life? Giftedness? We have been given the gift to be the gift. The most satisfying experience of life inevitably is when we give a gift, something that really is beneficial and helpful, something that helps build a relationship. And as a gift, once again, it's not sucked up for oneself, but it becomes a gift always for the rest of humanity. In our human condition, so often what do we do? We take the gift not as a gift, but as a get. I got to get more. I got to get more. This is for me. All this stuff is just me. It doesn't matter about the rest of humanity. I get it. And so the more we have, the more destructive we can become. That's the danger of wealth. That's the danger of when we think of what we have as that's the important stuff of life. The essence of life is always to give. That's what living is all about. The scriptures has all kinds of information about the gifts that are given from all the different people. Mary, Joseph, Jesus, yeah. But all those other people who brought powerfully good things alive in the world. Once again, we need to be so very careful that we don't turn giving into getting. Getting is taking away from people. 
it's all part of our financial structure, isn't it? I'm going to go get that. So I want to pay as little as I can. I'm going to sell that. I'm going to get as much as I can. And where, where is the concern for the other people? I, I don't pay as a gift so easily. The one who receives it doesn't, or who, who is selling, doesn't uh, look at as a, how can I gift, how can I care for no. Oh, you might see that once in a while, yeah. But uh, so easily, so easily, our self-centeredness destroys the essence of, of life. Can we keep in mind gift and giftedness as we live our lives? Can we take the essence of our life that has been given to us and put it to use in the way it was designed for? All of the different uh, gifts that have been given to us in education and feeding and everything else, you know. What is that for? It's so that we are able to give what is the essence of our life to the rest of God's creation. Meaning we might even want to care for our environment and all of the stuff that is a part of God's creation. The peace of God, which passes all understanding, keep your hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. And may the gift of life that we have been given continue as a gift to all of God's creation.